here we go. Good morning. So my neighbor has decided literally eight seconds ago to start some loud machine. So I'm hoping that, that you can hear me over the loud machine and if not, just follow what I'm doing. Um, so anyway, um, okay, really quick word of scheduling. So there is live class tomorrow at the park. I have some spots still open, just a few, not a ton, but they are still open and oh, yay, Maya's here, yay. And so um, the sign up is on my Facebook page. I have emailed it and texted it to a lot of people. You can also access it through my Instagram page. So it's there. Anyway, excited to see you guys again. And then the other thing is, I believe we're gonna switch our virtual schedule to Tuesday and Wednesday. Does that work for you, Ren, to do Wednesday? Awesome. So then we're doing virtual Tuesday, Wednesday, and then in-person Thursday, because I have a live class I need to go to on Fridays. And so Tuesday, Wednesday, and virtual, Thursday in-person, Saturday at the park. Sound good? Okay. So today we are going to do EMOMs and I do have to say as a trainer, EMOMs are hard to plan because you never quite know how many you're going to need to do. So if we uh, manipulate this a little bit as we go, then, then we do. So you have 10 exercises. Every exercise you have the exercise and a number of times you're supposed to finish it within 60 seconds. So you have a full 60 seconds to complete the exercise. If you finish in 45 seconds, you have 15 seconds to rest until the next exercise comes. If you finish in 55 seconds, you only have five seconds to rest until the next exercise comes. So every exercise will come as the clock strikes 12 and we will start on to the next exercise. So you have 10 exercises we're gonna do. We'll try to get through them four times and then include warm up, cool down. And if we have time for any abs, we'll do it. I doubt it. But anyway, so your 10 exercises that they're gonna be, they're, I made them combination moves so that you can do everything. It's a double burpee. Yes, we did a bazillion burpees on Tuesday, but it worked out fine. So a double burpee goes down, you do a plank tuck and then hop up and do a front bound. So basically once you go down, your legs are kicking back twice. And when you hop up, you're hopping forward twice. Well, just once. So you hop up and forward and back. So I'll show you what it looks like before we do it. That's your one. Roll-ups are second, yeah, that's okay. And then third, you're doing a plank jack to a plank tuck, plank jack, plank tuck. Then you're gonna do a butterfly sit-up, but first you're gonna grab a weight and you're gonna do a weighted butterfly sit-up. Then we're going backwards to a back lunge with an overhead press. That's your fourth, fourth one, fifth one, I don't know, I lost track. Then you're gonna grab the dumbbell by the head and do like a kettlebell swing, but first you're gonna do a swing, then you're gonna go down to a squat. Don't worry, I'll demonstrate everything. Bulldog tuck jumps, just wait for it, it's coming. Then you're gonna do um, a forearm push up to a pike. Then you're doing a full bridge dip, and then you're doing a kneel down with a vampire and a jump squat. So that is your preview, but I will show you everything. All right, so those are the exercises. And as we warm up, I will show you what we're doing. So let's warm up, let's do that now. I have music playing, but there's also a power washer, so whatever. Okay guys, let's mobilize those legs. Alright, I'm here. Y'all, I'm sick to death of dealing with the music. If anybody knows how to fix the music situation, just call me and let me know because I'm sick of it. Alright, pull those knees up. I have I have a phone for Facebook. I have a, an iPad for Zoom. Take that leg out to the side. And then I have the computer generating music to my Bluetooth speaker, which only likes to work every now and then. Take it up and over because of Wi-Fi or Bluetooth V or who knows what, but I'm sick to death of trying to deal with it. Take it up and over and bring it in one more time. Up and over. And back in the center, open it up nice and wide. You're just gonna go side to side. Lead with your shoulder, shoulder to knee, up side to side. Good job, so. Ah, who is that Robin here? Good morning, darling. You did a good job yesterday. All right, give me four more. Four, three, two, 
and one, face the side, legs or shoulder width apart, take those arms up, and you're gonna hinge back, butt goes back, swing it down, take it straight up, swing and up. I want that back, back flat, butt back, back flat, butt back. And push those hips forward, push it, take it down and back. Woo! Come on, three more, two more, Last one, great job, excellent. Stay at the end of your mat. Straight down, you're gonna walk it out with straight legs. Hold it here, tap the knees down, right knee, left knee, right knee, left knee. Two more, right knee, left, right, left. Walk it straight legs in, straight legs. Pull it all the way up. Now this time when you come down, bend your knees and push it out. Hold it here. Right and left tap, right and left tap. Two more, right, left, right. Bend your knees as you push it back in. Bend them and straighten up. Here we go, going straight leg down. Straight leg, walk it out. Right and left, right, left. Only one more, straight legs, walk it back in and up. Bend legs, take it down and walk it out. Right and left, right, left, right. Bend those knees, walk it back in. Good work. And up you go, jog in place. Excellent, excellent, jog, jog, jog. Okay. Good job. Now we're gonna do some lateral hops. So I want you to come to one side of your mat. You're gonna switch from a jog to a pogo. So switch both feet at the same time. Good, now we're going to take it three to the right and three to the left. Here we go, three, two, one, hop, three, two, one, hop. Good. I am lifting my inside knee as I hit that other side. Three, two, one, hop, three, two, one, hop. Up, up, up. Keep going, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, one, jack it out, jack and straight, jack and straight, good, whoop, all right, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, back to your jog, last thing, we're going to step side to side, and then you're plenty more, step side to side. So now my, I just heard my speaker just turned off. It's like, I'm tired of trying. Four, three, two, and one. Okay, let me run through these exercises. Your double burpee. You go down and back, tuck it in and out, in, hop up, forward hop, and back. Okay, so your double at the bottom, double at the top. Let me show you. Take it back and in, back and up, hop, okay? You got that, no problem. Roll ups, you know. Plank jack to bear to tuck, you know. Butterfly sit ups, you know. Back lunge over right press, you know. Kettlebell swing to squat. You hold the, the dumbbell from the top. You start with the swing, straight legs, just like we warmed up. Straight leg to bent leg, like we warmed up with. With the inch worm. Straight leg, bent leg, okay? That's the swing to squat. Then our bulldog tuck jumps. You're in this position, fighting stance. Take it down, up, and jump, okay? So down to a little push up, up and jump. There you have it. We'll call them gator tuck jumps, right? Forearm push up to a plank, to a pike. So you're here, you do a forearm push up, pike. Forearm push up, pike. That's that. Then the kneel down is here. You go down to a kneel down. I'm trying to get through this so fast. Kneel down, vampire, pull it up, jump squat. Okay? And all the rest you know. So, we're starting with the double burpee. First, for the first minute, you have to do 10 double burpees. You have 60 seconds to get through as many as you can. All right, are we ready? Here we go in four. Three, 
two and one begin. Take it back and in. Now go at your pace. You gotta try to get 10. seconds to go. 15. Until roll-ups, you have to do 12 full roll-ups. 10 seconds. Till we have 12 roll-ups, okay? Man, I wish we had music. That's okay. Here we go. Three, two, start at the top, take it down. Woo! All the way. Jump up at the top. Don't forget the tricks here. Cross your feet to try to get yourself up. That helps a lot. You can push down on the ground if you need to. Try really hard to not push yourself up. But if you need to use those fingers, just place them by your hips. Give yourself a little push. Momentum. It's all about momentum. All right, come on, let's go. 20 seconds left. Keep going. Okay. Plank jack to plank tuck. Let's do 20 of them. Are we ready? Take it down. Here we go in three, two, one. Jack tuck. Now, as you're doing this, when you come in for that tuck, and you bring your knees under your body, try to get your knees down really close to the ground. So like you're doing a bear position. So you take it out, pull it in, knees just slightly off the ground. You got it. Come on, let's go. Pua. done. Grab a weight because you have butterfly sit-ups in 10 seconds. So a heavy weight. You have 10 of these. Let's put your feet together. Arm above your head. Give me a crunch and then pull it up. Keep the weight above that head. 12 of these. Come on, we can do it. Crunch first, then push it up. We got it, come on. I am at six and it's at 30 seconds. We can do it, come on. You have 10 seconds to go. That was 12. The next exercise, grab both weights. You're going into a backwards lunge with an overhead press. In three, two, one, take it back. You're gonna go down and press the weights up. Down, press the weights up. I'm gonna try to do six on each side. Try to get that back knee down. Good, you got it. Whee! Back knee down, press it, press it, press it. This is five. We can do it, come on. Press those arms up there. I lost track. <laughs> I'm gonna keep going. Okay, I'm gonna do eight on each side. We can do eight on each side. We have 10 seconds to go. That was eight on each side for me. All right, one weight. Kettlebell, swing to a squat. 
Here we go in three, two, one. Let's try to get 15. Straight leg, bent leg. Straight leg, that was terrible. Bent leg, straight and lift those hips every time. Straighten out those hips. Whoo! Straighten them, push those hips forward when you do the kettlebell swing. Good. In my talking, I've lost count, but I think that was six. That was terrible. All right, we can do it. Come on. Whoo! Fifteen seconds to go. Are we getting up to fifteen? Ren, are we even close to fifteen? No idea. <laughs> Five seconds. All right, three, two, bulldog tuck jumps. You're going for 12, let's go. Take it, push, and then up. I'll face the side. Sit down low, push up, tuck. Push up, tuck. of them. Okay. That was 12. We have 15 seconds. Here you have a break. The last one you did not. Next is a forearm push-up to a pipe. 15. Five seconds. Get ready. Three, two, one. Let's go. Push it down and back. Now notice on these, your hands are gonna be farther in front of your head than they normally are for a basic push-up. Because both the forearm push-up and the pike require that distance for you to go backwards. So here, you'll feel your hands slightly in front of your head. You should be doing what I say, 12? Yep. This is 12. Good, okay. So next is a bridge dip. A bridge dip is coming up next in five seconds. So you're coming into bridge right here. And mosquito, down we go. Take it down and up. If you are gonna do this, it's gonna be called a half dip. So this is a half dip. A full dip goes all the way down to your elbows and then you push up all the way down and then push up. What I want you to do, if you're doing the half dips, try to get 20 in there. Oh my gosh, the bugs. If you are doing a full dip, get 12 in there, 12. It's a matter of timing on this. The full dip is harder and takes longer. Ten seconds. Then we go into our kneel down to a lean back to a jump squat. Five, four, three, two. Take it down. Right leg, left leg, lean back. Hold your hands in front of you. Jump squat. I want ten of these. Elbows, lean back, elbows up, jump squat. Take it back. Whee! Elbows in. All right, come on, we got it. Five more. Four more, we can do it. Oh my gosh. 
One more. This is a challenger on those quads. And that is time. Woo! You made it through all 10. All right, we gotta do it. <laughs> we gotta do it three more times. Okay, so I'm gonna take us inside. So take a second, catch your breath, grab your water. I'm gonna relocate so it's not so noisy out here. This is where you guys can check your email for a second. Hang on. You guys get to look at my nose. <laughs> Isn't that fun? All right, let's go. Hi, I hope you have a good weekend. All right, we're moving in so my voice doesn't have to mess with it and so I have music. All right, here we go. Audible, called an audible. All right, here we go. Move the chair, move the chair. Hang on. Now see the music? It's playing here because the Bluetooth wasn't happy about it. So here we go. All right, we're ready. Round two, double burpees. You have five seconds. Get ready. And three, and two, and one, 10 double burpees. Time. We're trying to get 10. 
some of these you may not be able to get through all of them, and that's okay. Others you'll have extra time. That's five. Get to the other arm. 
notice the difference. Oh, that's tricep, baby. Big, big tricep move. I love this exercise. It's hard to do, but it really isolates and magnifies the work being done on those triceps. 15 seconds to go. I'm going to try to pop out two more. You are knee down next. Five seconds. Arms go in front of you. Kneel down. Ten of them. Three, two, and one. Take it down and back. When you come up, then arms go in front and jump it out. Arms out. Take it back. Don't bend at the waist. So I'll face the side so you can see what it looks like. Come on down. Straight as a board. Right there. Then let you go and jump. Down straight as a board. Let's see if we can get five. I'm sorry, ten. Five guys. Woo! How far back can you go? I want you to feel that pull in those squats. Pull. Ten seconds. All right, let's go all the way to the very end. Done with round two. Water break. Okay. Bummer is I don't have to move my stuff inside this time. So you don't have as long of a break. I know. I'm sorry. It was so much fun to look up my nose while I ran inside, wasn't it? Okay. All right. You guys are doing great. Super proud of you. We have plenty enough time to finish these next two rounds. All right, reset the timer. There we go. Okay, round three, sweat bucket. We have double burpees to start with. Let me check in real quick. Awesome sauce. Here we go. Move your weights out of the way if they are in the way of you doing that front hop. Double burpees, 10 of them. Here we go. Three, two, and one. Let's go. Pull those knees in. Pop it. Butterfly 
those feet together, push it up, trying to get 10. Keep breathing. Exhale as you push. Exhale as you push. You got it. Come on. Push, 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 push. Good work. Good work, good work, good work. Oh, rats. Welcome back to Booking.com. Come on, come on, come on. Try to get 10 of these out of here. Roll that spine up one vertebrae at a time. Use those arms to push that weight up in front of your face. You have 15 seconds to go. Good work, guys. Five seconds until you hit those back lunge to an overhead press. Three, two, one. Let's go. Don't forget your options here. So you can take a lighter weight going straight to the center. Um, one weight going straight to the center, or you can eliminate the press, the overhead press, and just do the step back, the back lunges. But your chest has to stay up the whole time. Keep that chest up, which means as you go into that overhead press, don't lean back. Try to keep it facing forward. I know this is a lot of overhead press, so it is okay to change that format into a lighter weight. 15 seconds. Try to get eight on each side. If you are going weightless, you are doing it faster, which means you need to try to get 10 on each side. Five seconds, kettlebell swing. Three, two, one, hinge at the waist, straight legs, bent legs, but the chest comes down in between every one. Chest goes down, chest comes up. Up with the chest, down with the chest. Up with the chest, down with the chest. Really hinging at those hips. Trying to get 15. This is 10. Two, one. So you're coming down onto those elbows. 
goes once again. So it's almost a reverse motion of what you just did. All right, technically, it's exactly the reverse motion. Your body's on the opposite side of this bent elbow. So the motion itself is the same. You're flexing your elbows, right? But the placement of your weight changes which muscle group you're activating most of all. Well, kind of. Can you get a dozen? You have 20 seconds to go. Five seconds, then we're going to kneel down. Here we go, arms in front, three, two, and one. Kneel it down, lean back, straight body all the way through. Bend your elbows and pop it up. Arms straight as you go down, lean back, elbows bent, pop it up. See if you are leading with one leg and switch that knee. Switch to a different leg. Try to get 10. Now, are you? Keep going. 15 seconds. Pull your hips forward as your shoulders go back. Bend your elbows, pop it up. Hips forward. Five seconds, three, two, done with round three. Ren, you're still doing it. <laughs> Totally, I watched, you got it. I know you got it. Okay, one more round. All right, we can do it. For the bulldog tuck jumps, I know that they burn like crazy, and they're a really good burner. It takes you most of the time to do it, that's okay. We want to use up that time and we want those quads to just burn, burn, burn. Um, I don't like bulldogs because I'm a gator, but um, we're going to call it bulldog push-ups anyway because they're yucky. So, there you go. Okay, let's do it. One more round. Double burpees at first. I'm just down on the ground to move my weights. Don't be deceived. Here we go. Double burpees. You got 10. Three, two, and one. Let's go.
Okay, that was 20 for me. 15 seconds to go. Then you got butterfly, weighted, sit up with a crunch. I like the word crunch. Makes me hungry. Okay. <laughs> Wait in front of you, here we go. 32 and one crunch and lift 10 times. Now when you do the crunch, use a deliberate movement. Think about what your body is doing and use those muscles appropriately. Don't just bring that body up in the air to try to get the weight to move. Be deliberate in this action. Recognize that you are contracting your abdominals, bringing the upper ones closer to the lower ones and vice versa. So as you push, you're making it a dedicated movement and a dedicated motion. 20 seconds to go. Trying to get 10. Come on. Five seconds. Lunges are next. Five, four, three, two, one. Take it back. Press and return. Try to get eight on each side. Now, where is your body position here? You should be at 90 degrees with both legs. You can press after you, after you uh, settle into your lunge. You don't have to do it as you go. You can settle in and then press. Let's get eight, come on. 10 seconds. Ugh. That's a lot of pressing. Kettlebell swing. Five seconds. Swing the squat 15 times. Three, two, and one. Push those hips forward. Sit down. Push them. Now this is the fourth round. By this point, I'm hoping you're getting the hang of the motion. It takes a second to get the hang of it. Try to get 15. I've got five to go. We have 25 seconds left. Maybe a 
pushing my booty up in the air too far. 10 seconds. You have bridges next. Five seconds till we hit those bridge steps. Half or whole. Three, two, one. You're here for either 20 or you're all the way down. And back up for 12. Oh, golly. That's a tough one. Back, rock, rock away from it in three, two, 
had one, you did it. How'd that feel? You figured it out? Figure it out, Ren? No, she says no. She gotta do it again? She gotta do it again? All right, we're we'll gonna do it again. We'll do another minute. By the time the two minutes are up, you'll have it, just like that. Starting in five seconds. Come down to the floor. Three, two, one. Right to right. Walk it through all the way. Keep going till you're on your high knee. Hands and arms off the floor. Right leg comes back. Plant it on the floor. Flip away from it. Pull the left leg back through until you're in starting position. Ren, watch me a second. Left to left. Pull it through. Hollow hold. Left comes back just like it was when you started. The right leg curls underneath you back to starting spot. <laughs> I just saw a leg just go flying through the air. I just saw... <laughs> Up you go, all the way through. Right leg comes back, reverse away from that bent leg until you are in starting position. Left leg comes through, pull through. Left leg comes back, pull away from it into starting position. Let's do one more on each side. Pull through, right leg comes back, turn around, left, pull through, left comes back, and three, two, and one. You're done. We're done. That's the end of the day. You did it. Great job. Robin, if you were here, you could have shown everybody. With, did you get it that time, Ren? And ish, ish, if I was there with you. Yesterday, the light bulbs, you could see them like popping on as people got it. Pop, 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 pop. Okay, bring your favorite leg up. Pull that uh, heel into your high knee. Keep your knees close together. We need to do a check-in. Del is here. Good morning, Del. Glad to have you. Keep your other, uh, pull your other leg up. Stretch out those quads because they did some good work today. Emos I don't do very often because they are not easy to plan. It sounds like they would be, but just the numbers always end up being just a little bit funky. So, that's all like a good Friday workout. Heel down, pull back. Press it in, roll it up, and reverse. Other leg, figure four. Good job, guys. We will stretch our triceps next. Because we did two exercises with triceps and one with deltoids, so pull it back. I really want to challenge you, if you did not do the full dip, to try to figure out how to do that. Homework is to figure out how to do that. Pull that elbow in, you'll feel it right away, working out those triceps. It is a really strong, strong tricep exercise to do that full dip. Okay, if you didn't sign up for tomorrow, sign up is open. There's a few spots left. Push it out, head down. We're doing it rain or shine, unless it's a deluge and has flooded all locations. Flip, head up. In this position, bring your head back to neutral, drop those shoulders, and pull them back, okay? You are retracting your shoulder blades. Release, give me a big deep breath. Exhale. You guys have a wonderful weekend. Good to see you guys. Thanks for joining me. Adios.